When we were little, um, a game we played was Mr. Brown, Mr. Brown, what will you give me if I let you down? And Mr. Brown, Mr. Brown was what the down person would say. What will you give me if I let you down? I was stuck on top a lot. And I would have to bargain like Halloween candy and bike rides and you can use my radio that I just got or whatever it was on the playground that day. Um, so I saw that teeter-totter, that seesaw, as a beautiful image of sort of the way that we navigate our domestic lives. Um, there's an up and a down. There's always a give and a take. There's a balance. So balance is at the core of that piece, obviously. The fulcrum is the home. There's a beautiful, well-cared-for home on a hill. It looks lovely and welcoming, which is, of course, what we all want. Um, and it is balancing these two sort of outsized creatures that are on this toy, this playground toy. And it is a game. Life is a game. It's a beautiful game. In this piece, it's very clear that the bird is heavier. Um, the bird's on the bottom. And the donkey, who seems to be much, much more weighty, is left sort of haplessly on the top. So what will you give me if I let you down is the question in that piece. And it's about freedom and responsibility and where those two are balanced. And certainly, I love my life. I love my children and my husband and the life I've created. But there are things that are out of balance at times. And I see things that could happen. You know, I could fly away. I could alight. And what would happen? Bam. You know, that, that would hurt. That would hurt a lot of people in this situation if I left. I'm the heart of the home. And I own that. And I cherish those responsibilities. But this piece is an exploration of that. The beast of burden being on the top seems to me a symbol for responsibility and the way that things should be. That's an avatar for part of my personality and who I am, that responsibleness, that, that need to do the right thing and toe the line, be the beast of burden. And the bird is an avatar for freedom, being able to be free and, and creative and do those things. Um, the smoke that's coming out of the smokestack shows that there's life in the house. And that smoke, if you look at the piece directly from the front, it props up the beast of burden. So the life that's being created in that home, in that fulcrum, actually supports that balance at that moment.